Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to find uh, the sum of this infinite geometric sequence. And we have the formula to find the sum of a geometric sequence, which is the sum equals a sub 1 divided by 1 minus r, where a sub 1 is your first term in your sequence, and r represents your ratio between your terms. So we can just label our terms a sub 1, a sub 2, a sub 3, dot, 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 right? So we need to know a sub 1, which is obviously 0.8, which is cool. Um, then we need to know what r is. Now remember, r is pretty much just um, the ratio between your term and its previous term. So I do a sub 2 divided by a sub 1. You could also do a sub 3 divided by a sub 2. But since they say it's a geometric sequence, we know that that ratio is going to be the same. So all I do is do um, 0 0.08 divided by 0 0.8, and that equals 0.1. So now let's plug it into our formula. s equals a sub 1, which is 0.8 divided by 1 minus 0.1. Well, that equals 0.8 divided by 0.9. Now, to simplify this, let's just get the decimal point over so I can produce an equivalent equation by multiplying the same number on top and bottom. So I multiply 10 over 10, and I get my final answer of 8 ninths. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you find the sum of your infinite geometric sequence. Thanks.